How's it going, peoples? iGenius here, and I just want to talk a little Modern Warfare 2. I'm not counting this as a super special announcement because I'm not announcing anything. Um, I'm just talking a little Modern Warfare 2. Um, I've watched a couple of the trailers. I watched the um, multiplayer trailer a couple days ago, and I have to say I'm pretty impressed um, when I looked at it. You know, it looked pretty good. Um, the graphics look better than in previous games. Uh, the weapon, new weapons look nice. I'm really happy with the addition of the Famas and the Shire AUG. Um, and I was really hoping those guns would make it into Call of Duty 4, but they didn't. That's okay. They're in there now. That's all that matters, right? Um, yeah, it looks to be a pretty good game. I uh, just hope that the spawn system's good. Uh, one thing I really hope that Infinity Ward fixes in this game is the spawn system. Uh, I don't think there's a COD gamer out there who isn't happy, who is happy with the uh, spawn system at four or World at War. Uh, yeah, because in the last in the last game, World at War, the spawn system got worse. I'm not sure how, but it did. Um, I know there's a new developer for World at War, but that's no excuse for a worse spawn system. In the next edition of a gaming series, I expect things to get better, not worse. Um, that's the reason why I didn't play World at War anymore. Is because there's too many times where I died and I spawn right next to the guy that killed me. It's it was really annoying. I got really frustrated. I thinking about selling the game right now. Um, the only reason why I play it anymore is because of Nazi zombies. And I'm starting to get bored of that. Um, it's fun with playing with friends, but uh, they've sold the game because of what I just talked about, the crap spawn system, and the, also another thing was that the submachine guns were way too overpowered, they just completely dominated the game, so, anyway, planning on selling World at War, just to try to boost up the, buy the War, Modern Warfare 2 fund, um, anyway, uh, sorry for the little rant there, but I had to get that out of my system, uh, whew. Uh, other things I hope to see, um, or not see in this case, are the elimination of crap perks. Crap perks are perks that award a sucky player because they suck at the game. For instance, martyrdom. Martyrdom has to be the worst addition to a video game ever. Okay, here's a little scenario for you. Um, say you're a complete noob. You decide to you know, you just got the game, it looks pretty cool, you know, you want to try multiplayer, um, you're looking at the perk setups and all these look pretty cool, and you decide to put on martyrdom because there's no other perks that look to be any better for a noob like you. Uh, so you're in the middle of, middle of a game, uh, you're doing okay, not that good, s somewhere in there, and this guy just comes up and completes it, completely owns you. <laughs> like that cat did to that other cat there, that's... That's funny. I'm not sure why I put that in there, but I had to. It was some little, some little idea there. So um, anyway, anyway, back to the uh, little scenario here. Uh, he gets hacked up on adrenaline and decides to teabag you. He deserves his little moment of video game pleasure in the oddest sort of way. <laughs> uh, it's sort of creepy there. But um, anyway, he goes up to teabag you and notices the grenade indicator, and it's too late. You are awarded a kill. For getting completely owned. That's just not right. Again, I'm I'm raining again. I apologize for that. Um, it's just really annoying when you when you uh, you know stuff like that happens. I mean, it, it makes me really hate a game when you know there are just additions that make no sense or award bad players for that. And believe me, Infinity Ward. Um, Infinity Ward does not want you to hate their game, um, so I can speak for the ma vast majority of COD Floor players when I say fix the spawn system, take out martyrdom, and balance the weapons. So um, I hope to see that in Modern Warfare 2. Another thing I like to talk about real quick is hit detection. Hope they fix it, um, I or at least see a better hit detection system in Modern Warfare 2 because I'm not big, a big fan of being shot in the foot twice and dying. Uh, please make it so if you die or kill someone, it's because you actually shot them in a place that would kill them in real life. I know that one shot in the hand would render a soldier out of commission, but they wouldn't die, right? It's completely stupid, but anyway. Um, 
Now it's probably too late for you guys to fix it, um, but if there's an Infinity Ward employee or somebody really high up there watching this, uh, please in take into account everything I say. Um, it'll help you help. It'll help us enjoy the game more, and you know we would, you know, buy, you know more players would buy it if it was good. <laughs> uh, anyway, I'm looking forward to the game. Um, it looks to be pretty good. Uh, there's there's going to be some links to the trailers in the description uh, to uh, let you judge the game for yourself. Um, please, uh, if you want to comment on the game, like see what you would like to see in the uh, in Modern Warfare 2, please comment underneath it, underneath the uh, video here. You know, tell me what you want to see or what you don't want to see. Um, tell me what you like about the uh, trailers and what you've seen. So. Um, Anyway, yeah, that's. I think that's about it. Um, this is iGenius, and I will catch you guys later.